Yeah, Mr. President, let's talk about Vision 2050. I've got to know this is a new blueprint for Rwanda following Vision 2020. And the goal is to build Rwanda into a uh, upper middle income country by 2035 and uh, a high income country by 2050. And I wonder how, what do you think are the keys to realizing this goal? We invested in our people. We educated them. And we are still continuing to do that. And there's a lot of work to do. We invested in health, public health. We built general infrastructure. We have invested technology uh, to serve different areas. Um, our people understand what to expect and what is expected of them in terms of their contribution. So we, we, we've done well in the last 20 years. The vision for 2020, beginning with 2000, uh, maybe we didn't get 100% uh, what we set out to do, but we are very close. Maybe we were at 80, 85%. So that gap of 20 or 15% uh, constitutes uh, lessons for us. There are new things you have to deal with, so there is an overlap mm -hmm. of uh, filling these gaps that were left for the period the past. But there are things you have to do as of now, and then thinking about the future. So we try to understand it that way, and also mobilize government and citizens to be able to see it that way, and to make it simpler for everyone. And can China make contributions? Well, to begin with, China has already made a significant contribution to what we have already done. Looking at uh, from 2000 to 2020, we had a vision for that period of 20 years. And in that, so many things have happened. China contributed to the modernization of our infrastructure. The China has contributed to health, education, and uh, other systems. So that is already significant, and we are, we are grateful that has happened. And the country will continue to be open to uh, international cooperation? That one is uh, indispensable. Uh, that one, we, we have to remain open uh, to partnership, to embrace uh, working with others and learning lessons from others uh, and even, uh, you know, really mobilize uh, investments, uh, ideas and from the rest of the world. But as we earlier talked about, uh, we have to be mindful of the fact that we, we, we are addressing specific problems of a specific country.